Hello and welcome back. As always, my name is Sean. This is Minecraft. And I've had a few unfortunate events. I went and used up all my diamonds to uh, make armor. I went AFK at the zombie farm to get XP. Came back. Somehow I died from a zombie. I'm not really sure how, but nonetheless. So I was able to make, as you've seen in the ender chest, the chest plate, but I lost the boots and everything else. Uh, but in today's episode, I figured in episode one we built the mine shaft, and since then we haven't really fixed it up and did what I wanted to do. So I've been shearing sheep over there, and I was able to spell out mine. I'm going to eventually do shaft, but the sheep aren't really eating too fast. So I want to run over there and just jazz it up a little bit. Portal sounds are just way too loud. But I noticed a few people have been using it. Uh, someone's not lighting it up when they do it, but we'll just put a sign there to say light it up. It was in here, right? Um, but I want to write mine across the top like I said in episode one or two. Yeah, right up there. So I got mine. I, I use lapis because I have so much lapis. So it seemed like the best dye to use. That and I would have had to go flower farming. Um, but we're going to fix up down there. That's why I got all this junk with me. But up here, I want to write mine. Just so people know. And I'm thinking, if I get rid of this, just push it back just a little bit. Can I reach that? I cannot. Let's stand on it. Right in this area. Oh, I should get rid of a few more. Let's go up. Those will probably be easier. And we'll get rid of this. And... And E. Again, I want to write mine shaft. So I'm going to leave a little room. Uh, let's back up a little bit. Because I'm a little too close to be seen. Yeah, if I write mine, M-I-N-E. And I can write shaft under it later. Alright, so let's do something like... this back just a little bit I think let's do M I N E and then we'll make it look good by doing can I reach over there cat come out to and then go across take out this Mine. Where's my shovel? Let's get rid of this. Take a little step back. We'll see how that looks. Might need a little bit of improving. So when you come in... Hmm. Well, you can tell it's a mine. I'll give you that. It's a little square, though. What if... Let's add this along the top. I hear footsteps, so, okay. Let's come back over here, and I think right along the top of that, we can add some cobblestone stairs. Should give it a little something. Can I reach that one? No. Like that, maybe? Let's see. I lost my good shovel. A little upset by that. Let's 
Let's see, it's gonna get dark. I think there's a bed still over here. There is. Uh, we'd have to push that back to make it look even, but that will work for the time being. Eh, we're gonna go down, so I don't have to worry about sleeping. Let's go down to the bottom and fix up down here. It has been getting used by me and I guess a few other people, but like I said, one of these tunnels that someone dug on the right side, I think it was, I think it's the last one, someone's not lighting it up, so it's a little dangerous. That's the one I went down. I think it's this one. I threw a few torches, but not all of them. Maybe. I don't know. One of these isn't lit up all the way. But that's alright. We're going to put a sign here just to have people light it up. Because if you're standing here doing something and a zombie comes there, that's not going to be friendly. So I want to push this back. See, these two are clear. For a good distance, I went. So maybe we'll add two more. Yeah, we'll add two more. This way it's... People can come start using it again. Let's see. I've got a little bit of clearing out to do. And I'm using a work pick. I did manage to get one. Hopefully I brought everything I need, but... I'm sure I forgot something somewhere. So that, that, and then I gotta keep pushing this back. Right? Yeah. This, this, st stair. Thank you. And what is that? It's a full block. Alright. So yeah, so I'm gonna push this back, make two more, maybe three more. And I'll jazz up the floor again and everything, and this should be good for a little bit. As I said, we can always keep pushing it back as far as we need for people that keep using it. Oh yeah, let me push this all back, get this all spruced up a little bit, and I'll be right back. And done. Now one thing I didn't think about when I first came running down here is the amount of logs this thing uses. So a lot of my time was spent at the top gathering trees or waiting for them to grow but it is done I added three and I have to get one more pumpkin to put here but it's complete like I said we can keep expanding it as people use it one thing I want to do while I'm thinking about it is leave a nice sign I guess right here right there's really no center please light up tunnels for safety. Please light up tunnels for safety. It should just be, please light up tunnels. Right? Thanks. Should be obvious. And, while digging this out, and I think this one right here-ish, nope, right here, as you can see, I managed to get four more diamonds, some more redstone gold, more uh, coal, which I don't need any coal, but this is all done, and while waiting for trees to grow, which is really entertaining by the way, I managed to spruce up just a little bit up here to make it look a little bit better. Let's get rid of all these since I don't need them anymore. Okay, take down this. I am low on wood, so I'm going to have to uh, get wood nonetheless. But let's get rid of this real quick. Flint and steel would have been easier. Okay, good enough. So I added... Oh, it's going to be a little hard to see with the tree in the way, but... I added a little cobblestone border, some stairs, just to give it a little bit more uh, 
feeling, I guess. I don't know. It just it looks better now. I'm gonna put some torches up there because it's a little dangerous. But yeah, the mine shaft is complete. Looks a lot better, and we expanded it so people can use it. Let's run off to the next project. All right, over in the shopping district. I don't expect anything to be sold, but let's try anyway. Nope. It does not look like it. Let's drop these off real quick. That's good. What I want to do here is make, I guess, a path here and a bridge to go down. Because I don't like the portal position, but it's already there, so we're just going to leave it. But I want a way for people to get up and down. And we can start a path. So I'm thinking, let's just do a little rough layout of the bridge. And I guess I could just use these. On how high it's got to be. Again, I don't like where this is. It's a little, it's a little odd, but... Do I have my shovel? I do. My cheap iron, non enchanted shovel. Alright. If we do. If all too many times we're gonna die, so let's eat. If we do it here, will that make it high enough? Don't know. Well, I might have nailed it. Look at that. Yep, good. And then I can just go across with. I don't have any bricks on me. I do not. Now we have to get more more supplies, but at least we know where we start the bridge. And the path. I'll bring this. Down might work. I'm gonna push this back a little bit, but try and keep it look a little natural. And I have to run back and grab. I don't have any in my chest, do I? No. One in here I can use. No. If I make the path going. Hmm. Let me go get some stone bricks. Since that seems to be what the path is being made out of everywhere. And then we can just choo, make a little path there and people can continue on it that way and that way. And this way. Let me get some stone bricks. Bear back. Alright, so simple little path. I can add in the stairs. Nope. 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 Let's see. From down here, it seems a little easier. Start it from the bottom. And this. Oh, that ain't gonna work. And there. Okay, so that gets that. We'll have to add. That or half slabs? I guess half slabs would look better. Yeah, because it doesn't divide it too much. Let me make some half slabs. And same thing down here. Just do this. Place one too many. Let's make a few half slabs. I did grab a bunch of stone brick, or stone to make brick. So. Oh, I had some already. Alright. No, don't need to do that either. Alright. Can I have my stone, please? Thank you. I'm thinking we can just do this. And let's get rid of these. And just make it go down with it. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. That'll work, right? 
stone on top. Yeah, we could just put this and put this on top. And then same thing here, just go like that. Nope. Okay, that's working. Don't think there's a bed over here, so this is going to get interesting in a minute. Can I reach that? Beep. Oh, I thought I had it too. Okay. Let's come up here and just finish this off. Um, yeah, we'll do that. That's cool. Since this is going to go down a little bit, where's my stairs? Let's move this out of the way. With the axe. And let's just go up here. Good. Well, I guess I should make that even, huh? So the center is here. Like that. Do that. That. Good? Maybe? You. That works. Let's replace this. And the path can keep going that way. Again, it is nighttime now, so now I'm a little worried. I'm going to replace this, and we should be good. Alright. Why does that seem different? Oh, I see. Okay. I want to... Place a torch here. Nope. To make the path for this way, but I don't think it's really going to work that way since his front door is here. So I'm kind of just going to leave it and see what he wants to do. But this is started at least. Let's do this. It looks weird, right? There we go. Yeah, there we go. So now there's a path to my shop. The path can continue this way. And again, I don't know how to do this, because this front door is right there. Really? He'd have to switch it on one of the sides and make the path go down. Probably right here is probably the easiest. Hi, friend. But yeah, that's enough for over here. Let's run off back to the base. Oh, he went in. Oh, that's going to be fun. Let's see if I can not die. Okay. Let's run back to the base. Okay, we could fix this to make it look more in sync with the rest of it. Okay. Looking good, looking good. Here's something odd. I sheared this guy. He was walking around without wool. And now he has his coat back. There is no grass for him to eat. Unless he can eat grass through these slabs. Which would be interesting. I wonder. Where are my shears? There we go. Can you eat... Can you come over here? I need this for science. What did you eat? Really, dude?
of this. That'll get you where I want you. You, come this way. No, dude, seriously? You are so annoying. I wonder if he did eat it through there or if he just... After time gets it back? I don't think so. Hey, you. Come this way. Come on. Now stay over here. And eat... Eat wool. Eat grass, rather. Look, he can. I did not know that. That is interesting. So he can eat it through the half slit. So I wonder... Hmm. That's got me thinking. Alright, guys. That's going to do it for this episode. Uh, it was more of a maintenance episode. We got the mine shaft fixed up. We fixed up over here. Discovered that sheep, probably cows and everything else, can eat through... Uh, half slabs, so that's fun. Uh, next episode, we're going to run over to the farming district, because when I was caving, I found two beetroot seeds inside of a dungeon chest, a zombie spawner, which we're going to use in the future. And I think it's over... came that way, over that way. But we're going to run over to the farming district and work on a few things over there next episode. So as always, my name is Sean. This is Minecraft, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Check it next time.